Hello everybody, this is Solo <laughs> on my first solo run <laughs> with a game called Finger Bones. I have never played nor seen anything about this game, but other than that, let's get into it. Finger Bones, a psychological horror game by David Simansky. I'm sorry if I got that wrong. Finger Bones is intended to be completed in a single set sitting. There is no save function. It is suggested that you set aside about half an hour to complete it. To exit, visit the door you're, you started at. Use WASD to move. move and the left mouse button to interact with the environment. Press escape to toggle the screen and press I to invert the mouse. Let's get on into it. Ooh. Ah! Bright sun. Ooh. Some spider webs. This is actually quite an interesting little area. Can I click anything? Am I able to pick anything up or? Nah, it doesn't seem like I'm able to really do anything. Well, we'll see. Okay, so... Huh. Is there a door I'm supposed to go through, or do I grab something? Oh. Okay, one second. Mouse sensitivity needs to go down a bit. It appears to be a page of from a manuscript. Pop morality is too reliant on emotions, and not reliant enough on rational thought. If morality must be determined, and I maintain that, that it is a farce, it should not be determined by feeling. Feelings are nebulous, subjective, and changeable. Rather, it should be determined by thinking. The action of a nat natural creature are natural and thus moral, unless a concrete scientific reason can be given to prove them immoral. Okay, that's it. Well, that's that. Yeah, okay. Well, that was interesting. Is there anything else I can click? Ooh. The circle got bigger over there. Okay, let's see. Okay, well. Okay, I can't do anything with that. How about up here? No? Oh! Am I blind? Was I supposed to just go straight in this door? Wow. Wow, I feel dumb. Exit. Okay, so that's not what I was supposed to do. <laughs> I feel dumb, but we'll just continue on trucking with this. See where it takes us. So I'm guessing I have to look at the paper again, most likely. But we already read it, so I'm just gonna look at it real fast, and then we're we'll be. Uh, okay, so we looked at it. Now, um, huh. I bet you it's really obvious what I'm supposed to do, and I'm just dumb as piss. Come on. That doesn't do nothing. What the heck? Is there anything on this table? Ooh, there's another paper. There we go. It's my weekend to get Katie, but I'm really not in the mood. I distracted her with the TV and came here to read. I couldn't interest myself in reading, so I tried to write. I couldn't write anything more than the usual handful of disconnected thoughts and theories. Medication didn't help the divorce certain it didn't help and the divorce certainly didn't help because I am not depressed. I am enlightened. This is the result of two decades of scientific education and philosophical pondering. This is the price of knowledge. Huh. Okay. Now I uh, I have heard that this is a horror, so I, I'm a little scared, a little worried. I'm also very confused. Ooh, can I pick that? Aha! Ha ha ha. Aha! There's another paper. I don't know why I'd use my daughter's name as a door lock code in my survival bunker, but whatever keeps her happy, I suppose. 
She's like her mother, a delicate, fragile version of her mother. Damn her. Okay then. Well, someone doesn't like their ex-wife. Uh, let's see. Well, I guess I'll do something with that later. So what's the daughter's name? Is that, is that something I'm supposed to figure? Oh, I can see the keys now. Oh, gotta go around the stupid chair. Uh. So, I probably put in the daughter's name when I find it, right? Huh. Oh, there's another door. Okay then. Huh. Ooh, a button. Oh my. That scared the piss out of me. Oh my god. That scared the crud out of me, man. Oh! Oh, this is working now. Okay. Okay, so... Oh. I... I don't know. Larry. There we go. Larry. Did I do it? Oh. It's not Larry. Darn. Gosh, that thing is loud. Uh... Oh, maybe I can go through this door now. God, this thing is loud as crud. Did it say my daughter's name somewhere in here? Did it say it on one of the papers? Katie! God, I'm dumb. Okay, Katie. That's her name. There we go. If you guys haven't noticed, I have a hard time putting two and two together. Okay, so her name is Katie. There we go. Oh no, it's not Katie? Is it not Katie? This is scary. <laughs> I, I don't take scary games very well. Okay. I guess I go in here. Ah! Please no. No, that's that's terrifying. That is terrifying as hell. Don't do that again, please. Here? Oh. It finally happened. The whole world is a chaos of thunder and screams. And when the ashes settle, we will all be wild animals again. I'm ecstatic beyond words. I haven't been able to reach Lynn for several... Oh god! Chills! Oh god! I haven't been able to reach Lynn for several days, and she's probably dead for all I know or care. But Katie was here when it started, and I have no idea what to do with her. Most of the town is dead. Katie and, and I only survived because we ran to the bunker. Perhaps this is what I've needed. Freedom is all is from all the irrational rules and inane social values, just pure beautiful survival. Katie Katie I'm confused, Katie. Survival? Katie? Oh there's another paper. I boxed up everything that isn't practical and useful. I burned all the books that weren't for scientific edification. 
I'd like to store the boxes in the cellar, but I can't get them down the ladder by myself. I just piled them up near the hatch. The blood would probably ruin them anyway. Okay. 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 That's terrifying. Can I go down the hatch now? God. Katie, stop breathing down my neck, woman. Oh my God. Oh, here's another paper. The tool room has been her, her name for years now. I can't bring myself to change it. What the balls? Why is this? I'm so confoozled. Did I miss a paper? Tool room? Do I need to go back? This is confusing, man. Girl, you're gonna literally get me to kill myself. Okay. Um. I am confused. Okay. I've finally figured out what I'm supposed to do. Uh, do next at least I think I have but I think we go here and maybe type in the wife's name so that would be Lynn okay let's just completely spell that wrong uh, Lynn okay I, I, I think that's it uh, uh, I'm not sure but we'll see we'll definitely see I th and now I think I can go down into one of these rooms, maybe? Maybe, I'm not sure. But, God. Freaking Katie's scared. Okay, that opens now. Ooh, tools. Oh, can I get a hammer and hit whatever's gonna kill me? I'm... Uh-uh. That noise is not appreciated. I changed the storage room code to something I can easily remember. N N Y. The rest of the word is missing. N N Y. Huh. Okay. N N Y. Remember that, Solomon. Okay, bro. Oh, here's another paper. Here we go. Let's do this. She remembered Father's Day and drew me a picture. I don't understand her. She's just like her mother. She wants to waste time drawing pictures. Oh, brings shivers. And we're barely able to find enough food to survive. I turned her crayons into candles. We need more candles in case the generator goes out again. And it helps break up the monotony. I yearn for the excitement of those first weeks. God, am I the only one that's like really creeped? <laughs> there are things I've wanted to do for years, desires I've kept locked in the back of my consciousness. It's been nearly a year since I've seen a woman, and now I realize there's no- Oh! And now I realize there's no practical reason to keep those desires locked up in- No! Please, don't tell me this is where I think it's going! Why, huh? Oh God, N N Y. Uh. Oh my God, girl! I swear I'm literally gonna have a heart attack if there's a jump scare. Huh. Okay.
can. This isn't. This isn't extremely terrifying. No. N N Y. N N Y. I think I might have to start looking around again. Uh, I'll be, be right, right back after these messages. Okay, I think I'm back where I was, but I'm not sure if it's the exact spot, but who really cares? Now, I've been thinking about NNY, and I don't know why I didn't think of this. Lynn backwards would be NNYL. I'm not sure if that's right. I'll be checking right now. But we shall see. Okay. N N Y L. Okay. The beepy thing says I'm right, and then I'm guessing it's that door down there that I couldn't open. Maybe it's the hatch. I'll have to check both. This game is both confusing and scary. Two things. God, girl, you're going to... I'm literally going to kill myself just so I don't have to hear you anymore. I'm terrified that I'm gonna see something awful. He didn't... He didn't do anything to the daughter, right? Note. I am a bag of DNA, and I exist to make more of myself. I married and... God. 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 Okay. I wrote books and created it because creativity served a survival advantage to my ancient ape ancestors. I built this place, took refuge in it, and spent hours thinking up silly little artificial laws to live by because my forefathers built cities and societies to allow time and peace to reproduce and to protect these genes. Dreams, love, and opinions, desires, beauty, innocence, figments of our collective primordial imagination, fleeting electrical signals that oh, fire across our synapses for a pointless moment in time. They used to serve a purpose. And now they are needless confusion. And here I am, the last man on earth, for all I know, ready to be freed from them. Dude! Okay, that didn't really give me much. Is there another paper? Something that... Oh. Oh. I'm, I'm, I'm horrified. I go back to the latch, I'm guessing. Please, no, not what I'm thinking. Please, no. Oh, where? Oh my goodness. Do I have to do another stop and see where to go? I'm gonna check upstairs first real fast though. Maybe something different happened up there. I pressed it. Oh. No? Anything here change? Okay. I guess I have to... I can't... I, I can't believe that I don't know what I'm doing. the button? Did I miss a paper? Yes. Nope. 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 There has to be something I missed in here. Open this. There was that paper. Maybe if I close it? I press the button. Yeah, I can't press 
it again. Okay, I guess we're going to need to have another look session. Look, see. Okay, I have no idea how I didn't see this. Right here. Come on. Come on, Solo. Come on. The seller is freedom. Okay. I'm just gonna have a quick guess and think that I have to type in freedom right here, huh? F R E E D O N. Okay, that is not how you spell freedom. <laughs> I'm literally horrified. I am literally scared. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No. No. I can't do it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Oh Jesus god. God Jesus. Oh. <laughs> oh god. Oh. So she's going to die anyway, and I'm free now. Freedom. Took the end of all humanity for me to find free- Ah. Oh god, I killed her seems to have been torn from a diary. She finally died last night. I don't know whether from starvation, dehydration, or blood loss. I threw her body into the woods. Her fingers, my anti-religious artifacts, my testament to moral and intellectual freedom are locked in the safe upstairs. I am content in the knowledge that I haven't done anything wrong. Father didn't know why he'd come back after all these years, starving and tired. He just wanted to see the seller one last time. With one last flicker, the flashlight died, and he was left in pitch dark. He sat down on the cold floor and closed his eyes. He could still hear her even now. It was peaceful here in the cellar. Oh my god! N nah. Well, if you enjoyed yourself, I don't know why you would, but if you did, leave a like, comment, or even subscribe to become a soul saver. <laughs> uh, and until next time, bye bye. Thank you.